Are you having issues with your Wise camera not connecting to your Wise app? Well, I faced similar issues myself and here's what I did in order to fix this issue once and for all. So, without further ado, welcome to Bling Bling, let's get started. Your Wi-Fi plays a vital role in establishing a connection between your Wise camera and the Wise app on your phone. So, if your camera is out of the coverage area of your Wi-Fi, then it can lead to communication issues like this. You may have moved your camera to a different location or reset your Wi-Fi connection. Either way, you need to check and rectify accordingly. If you're not getting internet access on your Wi-Fi, you may need to contact your internet service provider and get that checked first. If you have relocated your camera, make sure that it is in range of your Wi-Fi. Ideally, you will be able to check this if your phone connects to your Wi-Fi from the same location as your camera. But in the case where your phone connects to your Wi-Fi and your Wise camera doesn't, move your camera a bit closer to your Wi-Fi router so that it is in range and check if your issues persist. You can also use a Wi-Fi extender with the Nest lineup of routers for added coverage. In the case where you reset your Wi-Fi router and can't get your Wise camera to pair with the Wise app on your phone, no matter how close you bring your camera to your Wi-Fi router, then you'll need to remove the device from the Wise app and then pair it again from scratch. I have a dedicated video on just that on this channel, so subscribe for more Wise content like this. I will make sure to link that video in the description below. Wise cameras provide a wide range of operations on the daily and are self-reliant to not require an external hub like sync modules for Blink cameras. Add the fact that it is being connected to power 24-7, the chances of power and charging related issues cropping up are quite high. A misbehaving charge within the system is all it takes for the camera to not work properly and cause connectivity issues in the process. This is where power cycling can help, ensuring that the charges from within the system are completely refreshed. To power cycle your Wise camera, unplug it from power and plug it back in after a minute. Now, I recommend you power cycle multiple times in order to extract the best out of your Wise camera. If the steps that I've mentioned so far don't produce any effective results on your end, then you can perform a factory reset on your Wise camera. A factory reset will help clean up any software bugs from within the system that might have restricted the communication between your camera and the Wise app on your phone. To reset your Wise camera, locate and press the setup button on the bottom of your camera till you hear a beep sound, followed by a ready to connect message. Now, go to the Wise app on your phone and delete your Wise camera from the system. Then, add the camera back again by following through the scanning process to get your Wise camera back in action. And that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about in this video regarding Wise cameras having trouble connecting to the Wise app. If you're still facing issues after following my guide, I recommend that you contact Wise directly and get the issues sorted. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more smart home content.